Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Janae. I run a blog called High Low Lux, and I love luxury beauty, fashion, and travel. And today, I am sharing, I think, 10 of my favorite handbags under $1,000. Always get asked, like, what's a good starter bag, entry-level bag, if I'm getting into designer, or just what are more affordable options if you don't want to spend the Chanel, Dior, three, four, five, seven thousand dollars on a bag. Obviously this is for people that enjoy luxury handbags, enjoy designer goods, so that's not what you're into. This video's not for you. But I have rounded up 10 bags. I actually own five of them. And then the other five, I kind of like searched the interwebs to find. I'll just pop them up on the screen and kind of tell you why I chose them. Um, I think that's everything. What I'm wearing, I'm wearing an Isabel Marant sweater. I bought it from Farfetch, I believe. And I'm just wearing black skinnies from Zara and no shoes because I'm at home. Okay, so without any more rambling, let's get into the video. Okay, so the first bag I have is from Michael Kors, and this part of the video is in partnership with Michael Kors. They actually asked me to pick out great gift ideas, and I thought this was a great <laughs> idea, and I thought it was a great um, way to include them in this video as well, because obviously these handbags can be gifts for you. You can be sharing them with someone and, you know, kind of hinting. These can also be gifts for someone else. So, so I chose one bag for myself, and I chose one to gift to my... Actually, I'm not gonna say the person because they might watch the video. So, one bag is gift, one bag is for me. The first one, let me get the name. The first one is the Soho Small Quilted Leather Shoulder Bag. This is the one I'm keeping, and I got it in the color Moss. She's a stunner. This is her, I don't have anything like it as far as color. <laughs> um, I do have styles of bags like this. She has a great chain crossbody chain but also you can double it up i really like that super versatile and then quilting which is like super on trend really soft plush leather and then you just kind of like pop that little clasp down and it opens up it has dividers on the inside i love that and the best part is it has a back pocket that's big enough to actually use so love that for me um so this one i'm definitely keeping because i don't have again I don't have a color like this in my wardrobe. And the price point for this one, I'll put everything up on the screen, of course, and link everything below. Um, but this one is regularly $328, and right now it's on sale for $246. So, again, great price point for an on-trend but still classic bag. And for me, in a really special color that I don't have. The one I'm gifting, and I'm only, I'm only gifting it because I have a bag this color, or I would just keep it for myself. But the next one is, let me pull up the name. The next one is the Bedford Legacy Medium Pebbled Leather Convertible Satchel. Um, and she is regularly $358, but right now she's on sale for $134. Is she not a stunner? Like the color, I love me, you know, I love me a cream, a winter white, an off white with some gold the crossbody strap comes off which is probably mm, i keep it on there but i probably mostly carry top handle i love the top handle bag um and this gives me major um um Givenchy antigona vibes the new style is like a softer um kind of style and it's like squishy on the sides it's exactly what this looks like so you get a really designer look for a great price point um i mean it, it's huge so you can fit everything you need inside and this is the one I'm gonna gift because I'm such a nice person. <laughs> but again, I love the color. It comes in a few other colors, but when I saw this one, cream with gold, mm, so cute and such a good price point. So, wanted to share that one. Next up, probably my current favorite right now is the MCM Boston bag. I love this, like I love this bag so so much um this is regularly 750 um so definitely under under a thousand dollars but right now blue nails has it on sale for 525 wow and it also comes again in like a light tan but i i love this bag so much more than i anticipated um it does come with a strap here's the strap so it's a pretty nice like thick substantial strap which i really like i never wear it with strap but if you like straps that is the option i'm a top handle girl i love that it has this little cognac detail right there and i love the embossing it's just i didn't have anything like it and i love how like long the zipper goes down on the side so like she opens humongously like my stuff is in here because i've been carrying it 
but I love this bag. It's super big, but it doesn't feel cumbersome. Um, and it just fits everything, and it's the color of the season. I love it so much. And it's, I mean, it's a great deal right now. So, love, love, love that bag. That is my current favorite. It's like in the weekly rotation. Okay, next bag is probably my third favorite. <laughs> Out of these is the Marc Jacobs Snapshot Bag. I adore this bag. I also got it from Bloomingdale's. Um, it comes with this strap. I got the color taupe, um, but they have it in so many colors. I, I saw this bag last summer and I thought it was really cute, but I didn't see a color that like was really for me. Then when I saw this color, I loved it. But now I have it in a matte black with matte black hardware. And you know, you're just like, did I get, did I get it too soon? Because now I feel like I need that one too. Um, mine has cream on top. It has two openings, which I love actually. Oh, receipts. <laughs> two openings. Um, it has a little back pocket, but you can't really use it. So, um, but again, super cute. I have a strap off because I store it just like this on my shelf. Um, but the, the strap detail is kind of what sold me on this one because I love gold and I love black. So, and I love cream. And that's the strap. I mean, look at it like with a coat, something simple. I love kind of like throwing this on. As far as price, this starts at $2.95. I'm pretty sure mine was $2.95, but they go up to $3.50 depending on the like details. Um, that matte black one that I was talking about is, I put it on the screen, is $3.25. But this bag is super cute. Obviously you have to be into small bags, but I love this one, it's just like, an accessory kind of like outfit topper um, in the fall and winter I also wear crossbody bags more I don't really wear them in the spring and summer so this is kind of a great one when you're going to be outside or you're kind of like you know running errands or running around and you want to throw something on to kind of like add some interest to your outfit I love throwing on a crossbody bag with a cool strap so love that one love that one for us and then the next bag let me pull up the price she is my second favorite after the MCM bag um, because I just grab, I reach for her way more than I thought. She's so easy to wear. I don't have to think too hard about it. Um, no wear and tear, like I've had it for a while. Okay, it's this one. This is the Stowed Soft Pleated Moon Bag. Um, and this one is $3.95. It comes in also a ton of colors. It comes in like suede, leathers, tan, um, cream I've seen it in a ton of colors I got it in black um, and it's super it looks big but it doesn't fit a ton but it fits everything I need um, and then it has this little thing on the top that says stowed you can also take this off I don't know why you would but if it's too much for you can take it off but it's just again such a cool just like design and just interesting bag when I feel like my outfit is a little plain I can grab this because it's just such a cool shape. It's a great way to add interest to an outfit, but not overdo it. Like sometimes there's too much hardware on certain bags I have, or you know, they just stand out too much, and I need something that's a little more streamlined. And I always reach for this. And again, because there's no hardware, it goes with so much. So same thing can be true with any color you get because there's no hardware on any of them. I love the gathering. And again, this is, she's plush. She is plush. So I feel like this is just a great bag for the price point. I'm gonna say, I think I got this from Shopbox. Again, I'll link everything below. So those are, yes, those are all the bags I actually have. Now, let's get into the bags that I have scoured the internet for to share with you guys. I have a list in my notes. And now I feel like I need like, well there's five, I feel like I need three of them. Um, so yeah, I love you. Um, the first one, oh, the first one is so cute. It is the Off-White Jitney Suede Shoulder Bag. Of course, I will pop up a picture over here. <laughs> um, and I specifically like it in a suede, but it comes in a bunch of different colors. And she is regularly $12.40, but right now on Farfetch, she is 30% off for $8.68. And I looked up this bag in several colors and they all seem to be on sale. So I don't know if they're discontinuing it or maybe coming out with colorways but every color I saw was on sale for under $1,000. Um, it has, again, it has a top handle and a long strap that is just my favorite combo. Like, I, I like change, like, don't box me in. Let me be versatile and you do both. So I love that. The next one is from Off-White and it is a tote. It's the Off-White Medium Local Print Box Bag. Okay, not a tote, it's called a box bag. Um, this is just super sleek. Uh, I feel like with a nice coat, this would look really cool, especially if you are still going into work or you like to carry around like 
just more items. It's kind of a larger bag. And I mean, off white is just cool. That's why I picked two of them. <laughs> um, they're just like cool. They really just popped out to me. I love just the black. It's kind of like shiny. I want to say it's patent. And then off, it says off white. It doesn't have the actual logo. This one is regularly $12.90. Um, and right now on Farfetch is 40% off. So it's $7.74. So great price point for a higher end. Okay, right, the next bag on my list is from Stella McCartney. It's the Hobo Shoulder Bag. And she is at $9.80. This is a new bag and it is so stunning. It's definitely all of the like plush, oversized kind of that vibe. So if you like bigger bags, this one's for you. And I love how they, it's not really embossing, it's like etching, I'm not sure what to call it, but they have the logo of Stella McCartney like etched into the bag. So it's not like hardware, again, so it still makes it really versatile. Hobo style is coming back stronger than ever. So like really big, you know, kind of like droopy bags you can put on your shoulder. Like that is going to be really big. And I feel like carry well into spring and summer too because hobo is more of a summer style. So, um, also I picked this color because, hello, it's the year of brown. <laughs> um, and this is just like the perfect buttery, soft, um, tanny kind of brown. It's not super chocolate, but it's like a very rich tan, peanut, caramel type of color. Love that one. Um, it is important to keep in mind Stella McCartney does not use real leather. So again, you're paying for the brand and the, the design. Um, so it's one of the priciest bags on my list and it's not leather, but I still really like it. So I wanted to include it. Next up is a brand I have never heard of, but it's a stunner. It's actually kind of like the Stella McCartney bag. Um, it's the brand UCC Sister. Um, it is the Lucas Leather Shoulder Bag and it is $6.37 and it is just, it reminds me a lot of the Stow bag also. It's just, as far as like interesting shape um, and style, it's kind of, looks like the Bottega um, pouch bag on the bottom, but then it has like a little curve at the top with a top handle and then it also has a long crossbody strap. Really liked it. I also picked it in a brown tan type of color. It's just so rich and so pretty. And it has, um, the hardware is like a bronzy gold, um, but it just has hardware on the side. And it seems like it opens kind of like, kind of like the Bottega Clutch, so um, pouch bag. So I really, really liked that one. And then lastly on my list, I had to give us a little classic staple, but also some nice bold hardware. So this one is by JW Anderson. It's the Anchor Logo Black Crossbody Bag. I really, really like this one. Um, it reminds me of like the Celine Box Bag, but way more logo <laughs> and hardware. Um, it has a JW um, emblem on the front and then it has a braided crossbody strap. Just a classic style. I love black and gold. You can't go wrong, it's super classic. And the price point, it's regularly $7.39 and right now it's $4.81. So I, I thought that was a really good price point and just a really classic style. Also something a little different. That's what I tried to pick with all of these. Of course, the ones I already own, but then also the ones that I picked, they're not just like standard bags you see all the time and you can get this random color for under thousand dollars. These are like cool, innovative, you know, new styles or, you know, just something you won't see everywhere. So that was my hope with this list because I've watched videos like this before. Um, and it's easy to kind of pick like the same kind of bags that are under a thousand dollars. So I feel like these are all kind of like unique, special, interesting designs. So hopefully you enjoyed it. Okay, so those are my 10 handbags for under a thousand dollars. I hope this video was helpful. Um, you guys said you wanted more handbag content. So let me know if you have any suggestions below. I am doing vlogmas. So again, leave me any kind of like ideas of videos you want to see. And I think that's everything. I will of course link every bag that I showed below. Make sure you check out Michael Kors. And thank you again to them for sponsoring today's video. Um, they are having a really big sale coming up. So make sure you check the links below and check out the bags that I shared with you. I think that's everything. Thanks for stopping by. See ya.